Oh, we're going to have more stuff to salvage here. We're getting some help from the, uh, who is this? The Saracen? Oh, they're trying to scan now. I see how it is. I see how it is. And now they're firing back. Their shields are already down. They're done. You're not getting through my shields. Uh, I don't think. Do I not have shields up? What's going on? Welcome back, folks. We are continuing with Space Haven Alpha 6, HSS Xanthip, and the HSS Core. Did a whole bunch of remodeling on the previous episode. Let's start it off. All oh, these lovely little errors. We are running low on water. That is very true. So we're gonna prepare because we just jumped into the we just jumped into this system. Just playing RimWorld, so my uh, hotkeys are all dorked up again. And we are ready to jump as soon as that shuttle comes back and stops uh, malingering over here. Come on. Get back in your bay. And we're ready. We have water available right here. I don't know how much. And a derelict. So we're going to get that. Okay, one derelict, and we've got this. So we're going to go here. That way he can shield him from pirates. Not that much mineable ice. Unfortunate. Mediocre. I got power issues to resolve over here that'll get done when people build things. Who's available to go clear a ship? All right, that's set up. So we're heading on out to go do things. What are we into? Looks like they're just getting up for their shift. So, Aueva and Federico, the uh, dream team, are going to go in. And dock with this bad boy. Away we go. I like to undock or undraft this shuttle so I can go do things. It's not like they need it right away anyways. Take some shots. Ooh. Well, there goes that uh that heater. <laughs> Let's sweep into this hallway. I don't know why the shuttle wants to keep coming back. It's very strange. I have a feeling the eggs are up here. I should probably go deal with that first. That should always be your priority. Take care of that egg spawner. Which is probably in here, but it could be in here. We'll see. Nope, not in the engine room. Sweep this hallway. Federico's doing some trick shots over there. Aha, there it is. Let's get in. All right, we got that down. Hey, there's another crew member. Nice. Nice. Let's go get him out of here. I don't think I know exactly who this is. That is the one, the only, the Yoda's Varnus. We'll see what he does here in a bit, but he can head back to the shuttle. Got that other big bastard. Go clear this. We'll come back here and clear this area. A lot of aliens back here. Does that mean there's another egg layer? Man. We're just smoking them left and right. Alright, we only got a few more rooms to clear and then we're out of here. Atmospherics is clear. What else we got over here? Got the engine room and then an office. Is there another hostel on this ship? Is that what I'm missing? Where is that coming from? There we go. All right, let's undraft these two. It's the Sidre. Okay. Let's uh, take everything off of it. Let's 
good that it's got water. Uh, we're going to go and take all this stuff and send it over to the core. And then we're going to take a look at old Varnus here, see what he can do. Good, he's good at medical. He's neurotic. Good. Less work speed, but he can learn real fast. He was a sheriff. He's the sheriff of this ship. Well, let's see. Let's look at his work rules. We've got a pretty full ship at this point. Now that I've got six on here, I might do two on this shift, two on this shift, and two on this shift. Just get it kind of spread out a little bit. All right, Varnus, you can do operations, so you're going to do them. You're definitely one of my better medics. Get a medic on each ship right now. Uh, good, you can do industry. Not bad, not bad. You can't do all this stuff, but that's fine. That'll focus you on the important tasks over there. Let's look at our schedules real quick, just so we can start hot bunking at least. Yeah, I may pay or may put this other shift on sleep here and then work on the rest. So let's do that. Have a little overlap. We'll do free time before bed and then free time after that and the rest is work. Long days. Let's copy that. And then Lane and Varnus, you are going to be working together. There we go. Just have constant overlap. People working. Okay, where do we want to hook this up to? I guess that guy. A little bit of clipping going on there. Don't think that's supposed to happen, but it is. I may need another bathroom on the ship. I could probably get away with only four beds, honestly. Well, let's see what happens over here. When this guy comes in, we'll definitely trade with him. Good, getting logistics done. I like having that overlap. I think that works out pretty well for me. How's the core doing? Low on water. Yeah, that is the limiting factor in this. That will cripple your ship. Everybody's complaining about it. The Saracen. I think I've run into the ship before. Great. They've got some water for me. And I'll just buy it. Perhaps I'm growing a little too much food. That is a possibility. I don't know. I might be eating up a lot of our water. That's one of the few things in this game that actually uses up water permanently instead of converts it into something else, which then gets converted back or, you know, stuff like that. Good. Stripping the ship now. Plenty of storage on this bad boy now <laughs> for all the scrap and stuff. What is his problem? Oh, he was running out of O2. Man, almost lost Michael there. <laughs> yeah, this power setup seems to be working pretty good. So in the future, I'll use this for future ships. Power generator power node or power capacity nodes which then feed into power nodes themselves i think that's a way forward for all my other power builds once this is done i'm gonna get rid of it or at least flip it around and move it right here eventually i'd like to put these here so they're more inwards Getting logistics done. How's this doing? A lot of stuff needs to get moved off there. 
but we're working it. How's this ship doing? Everybody's on one shift on this one. I may switch that up. In fact, let's look at it right now. Uh, priorities first. So we have... <clears throat> I could put Mike on his own shift because he can do both mining and industry. I pretty much do everything. So, Mike, you're going on your own shift there, bro. Bruh. Uh, let's copy of Wavas. Put that on Mike. There we go. I guess Mike got up to go take care of the fire when he didn't really need to. speed this along for you folks so you don't have to sit here and watch uh, cargo get moved. <laughs> all right. Well, welcome back. <laughs> We've pulled all the everything but some infra scrap, which I really don't need. It was the, uh, the MIS, MAS Sidre. Let's look at hyper jumping. Got one shuttle out there doing whatever whatever it wants. Oh, come on, Michael. Said I don't care about the infra scrap. You really do, though. Or that's Mike. It's just another form of Michael. It's just the logistics of moving some of this stuff becomes so cumbersome. <laughs> it's so bad. It's one thing. Go grab it. Come all the way back. It's just one of those things I think needs balancing because it's, it just gets to the point of it's not really that fun anymore. It's, um, bring all that back and say no more. No moss, Sidre. <laughs> all right. Are we ready to jump? We are. Good. Let's get out of this system. We'll come down here and get some mining done. Although I may need to jump out of the system a little faster. Move on to the next one because uh, running low on the old water. And that's not something you want to run out of. Let's get this mining done real quick. Shouldn't take long at all. Oh, we're going to need another uh, cryopod. Or hypersleep chamber. The names are inconsistent across the board. This is good. We'll be able to get all that done. Get more refinement of chemicals and then get out of here. Mining's going pretty quick nowadays. That's the last little bit. Let's get ready to jump. You're ready. You're ready. We're all ready. Let's go. Hopefully nobody dies. Apparently there's an object not on the power grid. Oh, I know what it is. It's not a big deal. Uh, I can go here, here, here. Yeah. Here, 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 here. And then down here and then out. I think we can do it. Just come in, mind things real quick, get out, keep moving. Let's drop in right here, get her done real fast. I do like the idea of having a shift working at all times, at least on the main ship. Get a little overlap going here on this one on the core right now fleet management is kind of wonky <laughs> the 
Yeah, it's not like transferring stuff between ships is not quite as automated. It kind of works. It's kind of clunky. UI is being worked on, so I'm hoping that is one of the things that gets fixed or at least improved upon. I don't doubt that it will. Good. Mining that stuff real fast. While Varnus is up on break. You don't really have any skill with weapons, but man, I'm going to give you one anyways. There's nothing in that one. How about this one? All right, there we go. Let's get you a shotgun. I think you get a close up action. And that's almost done. So let's get ready to jump. Just waiting on ships to get back. That's it. And we are ready to go. An environment condition. I don't know where. Right down here to get the coal. Hopefully we get this without having to deal with the pirates. Or if we do, we've got one more turret than last time. So should be quite nice. Put you right there. Just keep it mining. going to be a very slow playthrough, I think, until we get a little more action, run into more cultists or anything. Let me check something real quick. Um, background. Gameplay? Where is it? Just get the music going constant. Because I like the music. It's good. I think while you're playing, it's nice to have those lulls. Remind you you're kind of in space. Get that vibe going. But not always. Yeah, we're low on water and energy rods. Good. We can trade with this ship whenever it comes in. Hopefully get a bunch of water. for them to come in so I can actually trade and maybe get some water. <laughs> Energy rods we're fine on for now. They just need to get transferred over. That's it. I think we've reduced our energy rod consumption significantly. The Perori. What do you got, Perori? You got water. I'll definitely take that off your hands and I'll just buy it. Good enough. Get that trade done, and then we're going to move on. There we go. And let's get ready to go. I almost think moving this stuff around would be a good idea. Like maybe move the crew quarters up here, but eh, I don't know. Or just build another door right here or something. A lot of quick access to get up to the bridge. I don't know. We're jumping. All right, we're going to go up here. That's right. That's right. We'll get this coal, carbon rather, and then uh, jump up to the next system and, well, the next little sector of this system and then get the uh, derelict. I'm going to send the carbon over here this time. Whoa, they got rolling brownouts. What's going on here? Are they out of uh, energy rods? They sure are. Let's do a little transfer of a couple of these. Let's give them five. That'll take care of the problem. Of course, there's a fire in the kitchen. Same time. Here you go, fellas. Some energy rods for you. Get your power back online. There we go. Everything 
everything is kind of stabilized. Just about done with that. And then we can jump to the next system. Sector. God, these, the terminology is hard. All right, one more little node over there. We're done. That's done. We can get out of here. There it is. And let's move. And we're ready. Off we go. Oh, just missed the pirates. They may be jumping into our system yet, though. So we got to watch out. At least be ready. Double derelict. Okay. Well, I'm going to tuck you back here, and I'll just be right there. That way I can shield them a little bit if I need to. Let's get this over on the core, because they have the refinery for it. Saracen, what do you have? Nothing I want. Let's get uh, Xanthip ready to go board. Who's up? I feel like these two, I'll wait for them to get off shift. Might do a double breach. Knock out two ships at once. Right, they're on their morning break. You can play some arcade games. That's fun. It's good. Vertas is doing a little dance. All right, we're going to do a double breach. You two, get on board. You two. You wasted your, your free time. Let's go, shuttles. You're on. You're on. I'm going to have you dock with this one. And you're going to dock with this one. <laughs> it's going to be something a little different. Two breaches at the same time. Synchronized breaching. Two derelicts, two shuttles, two breachers at the same time. Let's get this going. Oh, I can't just select them both. Are we going to pause, eject them, and eject them? It's going to take a little, uh, <laughs> a little personnel management going. Oh, there we go. We got the big guy. Those two can deal with it. We'll hold that position while they breach here. Let's undraft these shuttles. Enrico took a beat in there. His blood's all over the wall. There's more hostiles coming. How are they doing over here? Perfectly fine. Let's get going. It's going to be eggs, definitely. Shit. Oh, Federico took a big hit. How are these guys doing? Get over there. Sweep around here with old Ueva. These guys are just about done. All right, this area is clear. We'll have Federico come around. Oh, we got some eggs to deal with. Let's get you going. One more room for this crew, and they're done. Oh, no. Just a couple more. Wave a sweep in that hallway. All these two link up yet again. Oh, boy. The Leo's gaze. All right, that room's clear. All right, you can breach this way if I select you properly. 
Right, let's pause that real quick because I'm getting a little overwhelmed with my tasks. And so are they, clearly. All right, there we go. We can set this for transfer. Are those human steaks? Sure is. What are they doing with human meat on board? Send a letter to the core. All right, you two, just about done clearing this bad boy. Couple more rooms and you're done. Right, that room's done. We need to clear this little area and then come over here to the, the bridge. Yeah, looks like the bridge. We're gonna have to get you guys out of here real quick. Alright, I'm gonna undraft you. Shit. There we go. Now we can get you off. The Durandal. Select everything. Let's move it over to the Xanthip and get all this done. <laughs> God. Alright, so doing a double breach is a little difficult. There we go. Whew. It was busy. We had a lot going on. Alright, Saracen, you had nothing. That's right. They're mining. Good. Critical resources low. Whole blocks and energy rods. Yeah, it's not that big a deal right now. Could be worse. Alright, that is empty, so I'm gonna move it. I gotta move this first, I guess. We'll move that in line with this one. Right there is good. Everybody came out of that. That was a little tough to manage. It was a fun little test. <laughs> Alright, we can move this guy right there. And we gotta link this guy up to something, so it'll be that one and that one. Go the other way. Draw power from it. There we go. Yeah, a lot of tasks that need to get done here. Where is that pirate at? Oh, he went all the way back to the beginning. I see. It's way over there. So we'll finish off these two derelicts, come down here, hit this one, and then we'll move on to the next sector. <laughs> That'd be pretty quick for this one. Really, that one does not have power. I guess I need to move this one back just one. to this guy and then I want power from this that should be bi-directional there we go problem solved see if I move this yep that'll work right there nice let's move that one in and I'll do the same on that side I'll probably move these elsewhere. I don't know where yet. I do have room right here. So let's move this guy here. We'll move this guy right there. And then I think I can leave this right there. That shouldn't be a problem. Yeah, the core's always got a fire on it. <laughs> that's, that's just uh, par for the course. Go ahead and cancel that one. Cancel that one or dismantle it rather. There we go. I think this will work better because now they'll offload it here. It'll be a much shorter trip to get to the actual storage bins.
A lot of work getting done. Let's see uh, how transfers are. Not bad. Not bad. They're getting done. I plan on selling off that human meat to the other ships. Just because they're fine with it. <laughs> it's, it's weird. Cannot remove spacesuit. All right, we're short of an energy rods here. It's not a huge deal. We'll catch up on it. And again, I'll, I'll cut out this part for you guys. Oh, I didn't know you could do this. You can drop down this and then look at your entire fleet's holdings. Interesting. Oh, we got pirates coming in. Well, things are about to get interesting. Let's look at this. Interesting. Huh. Okay. Uh, well, you guys. What you got? Oh, it's a Saracen. You guys want some human meat? I got it. I'm willing to sell it. Looks like you do. Man, that stuff sells for a lot of money. <laughs> Uh, I guess I'll buy one of these. How about one of these? I don't know why I want it. How about two of them? There we go. Sold. Done. <laughs> I don't even know if there's anything that needs that yet. All right. So we're going to have a little firefight on our hands. We're a little better on our weaponry. Actually, no, we're not. Not at all. We're better at our shields. That much is true. I would like another fire or another uh, turret, though. I think I can get two more. Actually, I can get two more turrets on this bad boy. All right. All hands on deck. Want everybody on shields and turrets here. Everything else can can hold off. Stand by the PCS Horion. <laughs> Not the Orion, it's the Orion, but you know, it's funny that way. Uh, we are not quite ready to fire, I don't think. Oh, it's interesting. You can pick independently who shoots what. Yeah, we're going to pepper that bad boy. Get some. Got the jump on him before he can even react. Oh, we're going to have more stuff to salvage here. We're getting some help from the, uh, who is this? The Saracen. Oh, they're trying to scan now. I see how it is. I see how it is. And now they're firing back. Their shields are already down. They're done. You're not getting through my shields. Uh, I don't think. Do I not have shields up? What's going on? Where did my shields go? Well, that's confusing. Something is down. Oh, we're short on. Uh, we're missing some resources. I see. Wow, that's not good. Well, we got to take it down before we go down. It looks like we will. Well, that was embarrassing. <laughs> you got to pay attention to those, I guess. And there goes the Orion. They didn't dock with me, did they? Okay, good. They didn't. And we'll take everybody off that stuff. So I don't have any of those. I guess I got to look at what produces those. Not that. All the scraps going. That's fine. Am I missing some production here? Is that what's going on? How do I get those? I'm not seeing it. Hmm. Energy cells. I don't remember how you get those. I guess it's through scrap. That's that's the only thing I can think of. Sure, I'll have to look into it in a little bit. I'll let this vent out. Let them suffocate. 
because that makes things way easier for us, way less risky. How's the transfer doing on this? Almost done. Good. And this one has to go through. We'll get some of these. So we can actually recharge our shields because that's a problem right now. Huh. Intriguing. Still ripping all this apart. I feel like that's probably enough on there. Uh, I could set somebody to do a little scan on it. Let's do that. Let's put somebody on operations. Get to scanning that bad boy. All right, you some bitches. Yeah, they're all pretty much. Yep, there they go. <laughs> They're already prisoners. So let's send over the dream team. We'll turn that off. Where's Federico? Dude, get out of that thing. You have a more important job to do. You were drafted. I need one of my shuttles to come back. Come on, dude. We got things to do. What are they doing? <laughs> They're just sitting on the airlock over there. God, it's annoying. All right, let's go dock with this. We'll sweep it and we'll take it. I'm not here to take prisoners or negotiate with terrorists. Oh, their other shuttle's still there. Interesting. All right, you two. Let's get after it. Oh, there's a hole under the airlock. Weird. All right, that can go away. Continue to push through. They should all be dead. This shouldn't be a problem. Doing an external breach of the engine room, I guess. Odd choice, but whatever. Come on. Taking weird paths. Keep it going. Push through. We got one more room to go and then we're done. All right, this ship is now ours. Let's go ahead and transfer all the goods. And we'll get the salvage going on the core. Boom, done. All right, now we'll go ahead and cut this out for you folks because it's boring to me and you. Well, we got some uh, O2 issues, it looks like. Something I'll have to fix. I just noticed this room is dorked up. Let's look at the style. Presets, and we'll set this one. Boom. There we go. Problem solved. O2 should be resolving itself. I don't know what happened there. Because this room's great. I might need more. It's really not that great, actually. It's pretty low. Where is my O2? Well, it's got water. Should be fine. Huh. May have to isolate these two halves of the ship. We'll see. I think it's slowly catching up. I don't know what happened. So we had really good airflow going through the ship. No, no problem earlier. Oh, well, that figured itself out. <laughs> or it won't. What are we doing over here? Yeah, no O2. Plenty of O2. We're good there. How's power doing? Power is good. 
Let's look at temperature. Temp's good to go. It's nice and room temperature over here. It's good there. It's balls cold over here. Yeah, okay. And there's a fire in the kitchen. Go figure. <laughs> so what happens? In the current state of the game, anyways. How are we doing on this? Still got a lot of stuff to move. You can honestly keep all that crap. I don't want it. I feel like there's some kind of production that I'm missing here. That's what I'm missing. I see. I see. I don't really have room on this bad boy for this thing. Well, I guess we're going to put one back here. Yep, totally was missing a whole production line. So I need to get a self user on this ship. I guess I'll just put it back here in the, uh, where, where does it keep going? Come on. Right here is good for now. They'll figure it out. Of course, it's not on the grid. Uh, let me just move it right here then. Let's put it right by the actual power sources. There we go. Oh, it takes energy rods. Ugh. Well, we need them, so we'll do less than six. Oh, we got brownouts. Yeah, we're running out of energy rods, we're running out of everything here. It's not good. There's not much left to transfer off here. But let's select the things we need to move. This is done. This is done. As soon as we're done with that, we're going to jump. Might have to just go to the next system right out, right? Because I don't think I'm going to have enough. Food or, well, energy rods or water at this point. Yeah, we're definitely running out. Let's go ahead and uh, cancel that transfer and get you guys back on the ship because, um, yeah, it ain't looking good. <laughs> we got to get out of here. All right, let's look at the salvage. You're done there. You're done here. You're done here. Let's get out of this system. They're getting a little heavy on the core. Errors? Oh, God. I really need them to drop off a hyper fuel rod. It's like a transfers. Yeah, you have one set up. Let me go ahead and turn this off then. Let's get him an energy rod so we can get out of here. There you go. It'll be fine. It'll be fine. Don't worry about it. All right, you're good to go there. And I think we're good to go. What do you mean? No, not all hyperdrives are powered. What are you doing? Where are you going? Like that's powered. Well, there's no power. So I need this engine to get a stupid rod. Well, this is problematic. <laughs> kind of stuck right now. Uh, they've only got one left. What is your problem, Bertos? What is going on? You guys need power on your ship. Let's 
Transfer. Yeah, we got to transfer around. What's going on? Go. Do it. Get it done. There we go. Now you can jump. Let's do this. All right, you're on board. Yours. What are you doing, shuttle? I don't have time for this. I do not have the time for your games. Waiting for navigator. Why do you have a problem with the navigator? Why do you have so many people on it? Oh my god. Yeah, we're gonna do that other derelict and then get out of here because it, it probably has water. It probably has fuel rods. And then we're going to jump out of here. God. What a... This is... This is the slow decay. It's not some big flash in the pan where you get into a big battle and die horribly. Nope, it's quite the opposite. He dies slow whimper. <laughs> Alright, who's who? Or who's where? Let me get you guys back here so we can get a full compliment to go raid this ship. That is the plan, anyways. You three. You look like a great, great bundle of joy to go take care of this. Get on board. And we're going to dock here. Right, we're going to sweep this as quick as we can. Three, I think, is plenty. Right, let's sweep right through this bridge. First hostile. Smoke them. In we go. All right, those guys were easy. Let's keep moving. Well, this room's uh, quite empty. <laughs> Not much left in there. Hey, we got another crew member. Let's get him out. Got your back. That is... Magnus Ang Oh, <laughs> caps are on. That was Angus. That'd be Magnus F. Sin. Hey, it all fit. Getting a pretty big crew so far. Finally. A real slow start to getting crew members, but man, now that I'm getting them, I'm getting them. That's an odd hallway. Oh, we took out the big guy. Super speed and another one. Come on, you bastard. Let's get in there. Sweep this thing. Get all these eggs out of here. Let's get going. One last little bit. There we go. Let's clear this corner and I think we're done. Oh. Alright, time for them to get out of here. Because they're all about to suffocate. <laughs> Good. There we go. We'll get all that. I'll take the energy scrap and tech scrap and that's it. There we go. Problem solved. All right. What do you do, Magnus? Actually, pretty good at weapons. Nice. Go and get you one. How about an SMG? All right, good. We're getting all these guys back on their ships. Three on the day shift. Let's look at priorities real quick. You can actually do pretty much everything except for uh, industry. Not bad. Not bad. Well, you're not going to be set to not do something. <laughs> I want you to do everything that you can. Good. 
This should go pretty quick. Oh my god. Just got rolling blackouts. This ship's doing good because I think we have enough solar power to really offset it. If I offloaded some of the industry off of this, I think it would be a little more manageable. This is an experiment. Like if I moved all my industry and refinement off of this ship, what would happen? Well, now we know. <laughs> if I'm going to do that, make it a little bigger. Don't go for a super small ship. I would say do at least a two, a tube tile one, something like that. Those are transfers going. No, no more. No more in for scrap. No more. I don't want it. I'm going to have you guys focus on. Let's go ahead and look at this. Um, I'm going to scrap that scrap. Uh, what gives me energy rods? Energy scrap. So energy scrap and that's it. I just want you to work on energy scrap for a little bit. That's it. Get that worked on. I'll get you some energy rods and that'll buy us some time. Not much, but some. All right. We're just about done here. Good. We jump to the next system and get a jump on it. Aha. I'm kind of liking this setup where you've got internal uh, docking collars. More of an aesthetic thing, but it brings everybody closer to the central spine of the ship. Having this being mostly a cargo hold, I could reorganize this a little better. So it's not taking up as much space in such an odd fashion, but I think doing this staggered approach is pretty good because you can technically fit, I think like one more in there than you normally would. So as long as these loading zones are not overlapping, it's fine. But maybe put them closer to here, like one right in front of that, one facing the other way. Something like that. It's all stuff I'm learning for the next alpha. <laughs> are you guys done yet? Looks like you are. Good. Let's get out of here. Before we run out of juice. Why aren't you on your own ship? What are you doing? Come on. There we go. Now we can get out of here. Shit. We're going to need uh. well, we're going to try it. We're going to try jumping without a pod. I've heard it does nothing. So let's give it a go. Let's see what happens. He's not dead yet. He's just walking around. We jumped into a pirate. Oh, man. So put a little space between us and them. In fact, let's put a lot of space between us and them. That's unfortunate. Jumping right into a pirate in the uh, AO. <laughs> right, they got one turret. Not bad. Okay, he didn't die. So it's not a big deal just yet. Turrets, shields, get on it. Let's go to the tactical mode and start pew pewing. We got double shields, so you should be good there. And we can put double the firepower on them. Should be fine. Yeah, they're going down first. No doubt about it. Yep, having double double turrets. So double their fire, firepower. And uh, double their shields. Makes, <laughs> makes a big difference. Getting this back up and running was uh, quite good. That helped out quite a bit. That gave us everything we needed to get that up and running. Cool. Well, we can loot their ship if we want to, but let's look at this system. A lot of, uh, shit, no water. <laughs> God, that sucks. I'm going to have to loot this and then trade with these guys and these guys. But there's plenty of fuel in the system. 
So it looks. We'll have our little offshoot, which allegedly has some tough opponents in it. But hey, thanks for joining me. I think this is a good point to stop it and take a little break for the, not tomorrow, but the next episode. Uh, but yeah, take it easy.